Hey, Larry Ladowski with Midwest Outdoors. What a great couple of days that we've had here at Cree River Lodge in Northern Saskatchewan. I think I need a vacation for my vacation. As a matter of fact, take a look at the fantastic footage that we had from the last few days. Wow. The guardian of the gate. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Look at that. That's beautiful, Chip. Uh, that's a beast. Nice. That's a good fish. That is. Oh man, now he's way in there. Way in there. Jeez. Right on, Chip! <laughs> I love the head. Look at that. Look at that. Mm. Oh, you gotta love the fish. Look at that tank. He really liked that husky jerk. Come on, let me in. There we go. Oh. Right on! Oh, oh gosh. Oh my. Oh my god, look, look at that. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> what a beauty. That's a good one. She, I think it's almost as wide as it is long. Yeah, that's a great fish. Wow. Northern Saskatchewan, baby. I really like Saskatchewan. I love the remoteness of it. If you're a you know, remote lover, an outdoorsman, that kind of thing, then this place is fantastic. And obviously remoteness is a very relative term because if you're a silly city dweller, the suburbs might be you know, your remoteness. If you're a suburbanite, maybe a farmland or you know, vastness might be remote to you. But this to me is remote. Let's put it in perspective. You got Minnesota. Minnesota's a pretty remote state. There are, Saskatchewan's probably, and I'm just guessing here, five times the size of Minnesota, so five times the, the surface area. You got 1.1 million people in, in the entire province of Saskatchewan. You got 5.5 in Minnesota, so it's got five times the population in Minnesota than here. This has five times the size, and then you got 10,000 lakes in Minnesota, you got over 100,000 here in Saskatchewan. Like I said, I just love it. Oh yes, this one hit right at the boat, and then just went nuts. Good looking fish. <laughs> it was basically just hold on, hang on, let him do his twists and turns and shakes, and, and now he's straightened out, and now he's just starting to swim all over. And we started off here with with pike this morning, where Cree River is also known for their hefty walleye. They have some lake trout, and then they also have the four species, Arctic grayling. Man, that's beautiful. Oh, good fish. Ready to try a little walleye? Let's try it. All right, let's go do her. All right, girl. Thanks, see you later. This is a walleye, this is a big one. Nice one. Very nice one. Yeah. You know what I like about the fishing for walleye up here is they're they're just so stocky in the fish. Look at that. Big bellies, really gold in color. And that white fin becomes so prominent on that with that gold and then the black back. It's such a pretty fish. And so stocky up here. Nice one. Oh, another nice fish. Like I said, because of the northern climate that we're here, oh, you don't always catch the monsters, but these are thick fish. This, this is your better walleye yet this so far. This is thick. That's That's a, a chunky walleye. That's a that's chunky. That's a nice one. That's big. That's long, too. Yeah, that's a good one. All around healthy. Yeah. Meaty. Meaty, yes. Yeah. Very meaty. Cool. I'll show you what I'm using here. It's just a quarter ounce Google Eye jig. This has a rattle in it. And then it's tipped with a Berkeley Power Bait Champ Minnow. Just putting it down on the bottom, jigging it up a couple of times, and they smack it. That's better, yeah. That's a nice one. More better. Much more better. That's a real walleye. Yep. Nice. Wow. 
And that's almost too small for this guy. <laughs> so Chip, I mean, I know that Northern Saskatchewan does not have huge walleye, but tell us a little bit about the fishery and, and what you can expect. Well, Cree River has really the most ridiculous walleye fishery for as far north as we are. And this is just really an average walleye for what we catch. Wow. It's a gorgeous fish, but uh, yeah, we catch walleyes, you know, up to high 20s and numbers lots and lots and lots. And they're all just fat, golden fat, yeah. just heavy fish. You know? And we're sitting about three and a half minutes from the lodge. Right yeah, now. I know. So, yeah, <laughs> let us go. It's really hard to capture the essence of a Saskatchewan fishing adventure in a short video like that, but hopefully you have a really good idea of what a trip up north can be like. For more information, visit sasktourism.com. I'm Larry Ladowski from Midwest Outdoorism. I'll catch you later.